future to take a look at the Skeptics Conference. If a friend told you that last night whilst they were hanging out there washing, they'd spotted a UFO, well, you might say, you really need to stop smoking that shit. And yet thousands of paranormal sightings are reported each year. We're here at the annual New Zealand Skeptics Conference to find out if the truth is really out there. And check it out. It's build your own UFO night. Do you actually believe in UFOs at all? I'd like to. I really wish they'd come and land at my place. But I know that there are UFOs. Do you believe in aliens at all? Oh, absolutely. You do? Whoa! <laughs> There's lots and lots of hoaxes out there. We can demonstrate some quite nice ones here. What do your friends think of you spending this time, like time out of your weekend, to come to a skeptics conference? We well, actually assume I have friends, but... Uh... <laughs> That's why I have to come to these type of things. I mean, what do you think of Scientology? Uh, not rationally sound. I've heard theories that um, the whole Bush administration are actually lizards. George Bush and the Queen are lizard people. That is, they are somehow reptilian underneath. Is it possible that Tom Cruise is an alien? Actually, now that you mention it... I'm telling you, Tyra Banks, there's something going on with that forehead. That's all I'm saying. Oh, I have to agree with you there. I'll give you Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise is an alien. Tom Cruise, definitely. Conspiracy theory, but I'm telling ya. <laughs> Do you ever get bored of being sceptical? No, I get more excited every day. Do you think this sort of place is a good place to pick up chicks? Um... No. There's uh, a big sceptic movement in the States. Um, they do a calendar every year. Sceptic.org. What about an alien, though, would you? Well, it depends on what the alien was shaped like, I guess. And there was that alien lady, she had like four boobs. I just thought that was like a normal person with cosmetic surgery. <laughs> well, if there was an alien like that, would you go there? Absolutely. You really need to score some more ladies. <laughs> she wouldn't be abnormal in that sense. She could still have plenty of kinky moves anyway. You don't have to be an alien to, to do that, I'm sure. What do you think of people that say that they've been abducted? Well, I heard a lot of people like they drop like acid and mushrooms and they see some weird shit. Yeah, exactly. I mean, who's to say it? it's not that? Can I say sexual on TV? There's probably a sexual element to alien abduction as well. People having people who are fantasy prone tend to be abducted. What's with the, the anus? The anus stories. Always with the anus. Yeah, it's a preoccupation, isn't it? And it's all to do with the anus for aliens. Ah, UFOs. And the people that believe in them. Are they crazy and backward folk? No, they're just people who like to play with balloons.